Halli, hallo meine Lieben und herzlich willkommen zurück zu Greedfall. So, wir haben jetzt einiges herausgefunden. Die gute Frau war sehr, ich sag mal, aufschlussreich. Jetzt müssen wir mit dem Wirt noch mal reden. Can I get you anything? Look who it is. I feel that once again you're not here to support my business. I am looking for a woman who comes here. She always wears a long green coat. Yes, I have seen this coat before, but I have no idea who is beneath it, if that's what you're asking. All I know is that I've seen her speaking to a regular, a steward of the palace who comes to place big orders. Always prime choice. I have to go. I will leave you to your work. Jetzt soll ich wieder nach unten? Was ist das denn für ein Gag? Good day. Welcome. You here to wager? To f I am looking for someone. A woman wearing a big green coat. Yeah, I know who you mean. She's a good client. She comes in especially for the big fights and she has prime information. Do you know where I can find her? No. I don't even know a name. She wouldn't happen to be coming back to collect some winnings, would she? No, and I can't really tell you when she'll show up next. I must be going. Next time, then. Und nun? Nach oben. So, jetzt müssen wir da lang, weil, ja, woanders ich nicht, ich nicht hingehen kann. Ich habe mich schon wieder verlaufen, oder? Frage die Elster der Geldverleihung in San Matthäus. Irgendwie ist das jetzt hier ganz falsch. Muss da rein. Ja, die Stadt hier ist komplett blöd aufgeteilt. Wirklich, ich komme hier absolut nicht klar. Äh, ja. Diese Herren sind wahrscheinlich sehr nett. Can I help you? Yes, actually. I have a small favor to ask. You don't look like you need money from me. I'll get straight to the point. I have bad news for you. I know about the decadent parties at the palace. I know that you take part in them. What? But <laughs> what are you talking about? Stop acting all innocent. I have all the evidence I need to incriminate you. Although your reputation isn't spotless, There are others who have a lot more at stake than you. What if I were to spread it around town that you boast about being there? You know what happens when tongues wag too much. That's enough! All right, all right, I'll get the message. What do you want? It would appear that you know the Mother Cardinal very well. I know that she borrowed money from you. I even know how much. What I want to know is why. <laughs> I have no idea. Do you really think that my clients tell me everything about their lives? Does she still owe you money? No, she always pays me back on time and with interest. Do you think she is plundering the city funds? Ha! <laughs> If that were the case, the funds would have been depleted long ago. Nah, the money's coming from elsewhere. Tell me about Candy Cane. We're not close, if that's what you want to know. I just know his name, like everyone else. I mean, there are some rumors. They say he does his business in the basement of the Coin Tavern. What kind of business? Oh, nothing to do with my line of business. He deals in arena fights, which are beyond me. I would advise you to keep all of this to yourself. <laughs> I, I don't want any trouble. I will be as silent as a stone. So... How do you see things, my child? I think that the usurer is lending money to the Cardinal, and very significant sums at that. With this money, 
She bets on the arena fights while hiding in a big green coat. And she also gives large amounts to a certain candy cane, known for fixing fights. Not only does our dear Cornelia love betting games, but she also wouldn't think twice about cheating to win. Maybe he is just giving her advice. How can we prove anything? We can always try asking him. Who knows? Perhaps he will give us an answer. Für eine Zuckerstange. Ach ja, der soll ja genau ähm, am Hafen sein. Das ist ja interessant. Die Kardinelin hier, die Cornelia da. Betrügen tut sie. Ich meine, Wetten abschließen, das lasse ich mal da so stehen. Das kann sie ja gerne machen, wie sie möchte, ne? Aber dann auch noch betrügen dabei. Ich habe gerade ein Problem. Ich komme hier, komm hier schon wieder nicht klar. Candy Cane is not here. At least not yet. Remember, my child, the bookmaker told us that he hangs around here at night. That's true. You were right. Let's come back later. Oh, it's... Oh. Kann ich nicht... Konnte ich nicht irgendwie warten? das nicht. Na, ah, was mache ich denn? Oh, jetzt muss ich echt jetzt wieder hier weggehen und oh, das kriegt die Krise gerade. Muss ich bis nachts warten? Ich weiß sowieso schon nicht, wie ich da wieder hinkommen soll. Ich versuche jetzt irgendwie zu meinem Haus zu gelangen. Da wohnen wir. Da muss ich jetzt halt warten. Siora, dein Schwert brennt. Dann werde ich halt schlafen bis zur Nacht. Jetzt ist Nacht, jetzt können wir wieder gehen. Hallo, Siora. So. Und jetzt noch mal von vorne. Sie steht immer noch da und winkt. Hier lang, hier, hier lang dann. Ja, ich glaube. Dann hier lang und dann nein, einmal runter, 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 runter. Und dann hier hoch. Huch! Wir werden angegriffen. To my health. And death to the others. Your magic is running out. Ach so, ist keiner mehr da. Haha. <lacht> Voll angegriffen hier. Hä? War das richtig? War ich nicht hier? Muss ich nicht hier einen rein? Nö. Hä? Nochmal. Ja. 
noch irgendjemand hier. Das, ich war doch gar nicht so weit entfernt. Das kann doch gar nicht sein. Ich bin schon wieder genervt. Nach hier, oder? Ja. Er hat den Standort gewechselt, die Sau. Good evening. Are you the one they call Candy Cane? Who are you? Desarde, legate of the Merchant Congregation. A legate, no less. I imagine in these cases, the one accompanying you is the famous Petrus. You seem to be very well informed. Therefore, you might be able to answer my question. What do you know about a woman in a green coat? Why would I tell you? We know that you have business with this woman. And that she is actually the Mother Cardinal. How did you... You would be better off forgetting that. That's not exactly the response I'd imagined. But nevertheless, seems rather eloquent. I told you to forget about it. Or you'll soon run into trouble. Legget or no legget. Come on. It was just an innocent little conversation. Goodbye, Mr. Kane. Bye. And Godspeed. We have enough information. Really? Is the fact that she bets on fights that are potentially fixed enough for you? It's already a huge scandal. Let me just think about it for a little while. I will find a way of putting this information to good use. I have faith in you, Father. Good. Dann haben wir das jetzt auch. So, Kurt, jetzt bist du dran. Green Blood, my friend. I can't stop thinking about Rainer and what happened to him. Let me know when you're ready to accompany me to those bastards training camp. I need the help of my best student. How can I refuse such a request? Well then, let's go. Ja. Jetzt müssen wir zum Globus. Falscher Weg. Hier yeah, ist totale Sattkasse. Äh, Sackkasse meine ich. Sattkasse. Ich hab's heute auch mit der Sprache wieder. Einmal. Ich muss nur zu irgendeinem Globus. Der Rest ist mir egal. Was ist denn hier immer abends los? Und da hinten läuft die Wache und macht nichts. Das ist auch so geil. Da läuft die Wache, die macht überhaupt nichts. Für was sind die eigentlich da? Äh, ich kann doch hier mit dem Globus, oder nicht? Dafür müssen wir hier hin. Jetzt können wir uns noch mal sammeln. Äh, Petros. Ich würde gerne die Gruppe wechseln. Und zwar würde ich gerne Petros rauspacken und Siora wieder, oh, wieder einfügen. Wir brauchen einfach eine Heilerin dabei. So. erstmal glaube ich hier raus von was werden wir denn an so oh die waren so weit weg leute ja 
Charge again. Drink a potion. Move away. Things are about to get dicey. Die waren so weit weg. Warum mussten wir die jetzt angreifen? Ich muss hier hoch, definitiv. Es gibt hier auch keinen anderen Weg. Ach, guck mal, da ist der Händler. Da sind noch mal ein paar Bärwölfe. Und weiterlaufen. Das sieht nicht so aus, als wenn ich jetzt hier gleich irgendwo abbiegen könnte. Oder? Doch. Aha. Das Reh war's. <lacht> Nicht überall Essen rum. Und hier ist... Oh! Das ist der diebische Gelehrte. Ach. Da hatten wir doch so eine Aufgabe gekriegt. Das ist ja praktisch. <lacht> okay. Äh, ja, wir müssen eh hier lang. Äh, wo müssen wir denn? Ich habe das Gefühl, ich komme gar nicht ans Ziel. Was greift uns an? Achso. Move away. Things are about to get dicey. You've no magic yet. Drink the potion. Gut, jetzt müssen wir hier hoch. Ah, guck mal. Hier sind wir doch richtig. Schönen guten Tag, die Männer. Hier ist das Phantomlager. So. I was informed of your arrival by my sentinels, but I didn't think it would be you, Kurt. Rolf, you're the leader of this camp. You two know each other. We train together. We haven't seen each other in a long time. A very long time. Hmm. The world of warriors is very small, Kurt. What brings you here, my old comrade? And who are these people with you? They're not one of us. My name is de Sade. I'm the legate of the merchant congregation. And I'm Siora, Donegad, of the Gaius Rad. These people sure are important. So, what are you doing here? I've heard things about this place. About this very special camp. And we wanted to see what it was all about with our own eyes. That's very nice of you, but visitors aren't welcome in this camp. What goes on here is only the guards' business. Does the same apply to me? <sighs> Listen, Kurt. I can give you and your friends some answers, but only because it's you. Anyway, knowing you as well as I do, I'm aware I'm not going to get rid of you that easily. So, what would you like to know? What is it you do here? And why is this place kept secret, even from your comrades in the guard? The natives have their magic, and we have to train elites to be able to face them. That's what we're doing here. Our role is sensitive, and our location obviously cannot be revealed to the whole island. Does this man not realize that I'm a Donegad? I noticed you're a native, but you're a friend of Kurt's. So I trust you will be discreet. I see the reason for this kind of training. The Bridge Alliance would be particularly interested in soldiers like these. And yet I've never heard of this 
elite squadron. We're still in the early stages of the program. We don't want to rush things. And our leaders demand secrecy. Orders are orders. Hmm. This is a huge camp for such a secret location. How's it organized? The main building is reserved for officers and the wounded. The front and rear of the camp are dedicated to combat training. But most exercises take place outside. Impressive. And how do you manage recruitment? Only the best come here. Those who have combat experience. Once they arrive, they're separated into two squadrons, each led and trained by a lieutenant. But you already know all of this, Kurt. It must bring back memories. Yes. Hmm. Will you tell us about your training? That's a sensitive topic. Most exercises take place in the field to get the men used to it. The natives' knowledge of the environment gives them as much of an advantage as their <clears throat> magic. But if you want to know more, you should ask my lieutenant instructors. Actually, we found out about this camp while we were looking for someone. A kid I recruited. Reyna. Oh. I didn't know he was one of yours. My condolences. I was told he died in an accident in the harbor. Don't insult my intelligence, Rolf. All right. Since you're here, I guess there's no point in lying to you anymore. The accident occurred during a maneuver. It's regrettable. But these things happen, you know? We've taken up enough of your time, Captain. I agree, and I have things to do. I'd like to question your lieutenant instructors, if you don't mind. To ask them about Rayner. You've become a real sap. <sighs> Fine. But try not to disrupt the day's schedule too much. Goodbye. I'm sorry. I couldn't contain my anger. <sighs> I noticed. Good thing you know this captain so well. I don't think he would have let us investigate otherwise. I'm not sure it's a good thing, really. You don't seem to like this man. Rolf doesn't bring back good memories for me. But let's continue. I want to know what's going on here. Oh, dann fragen wir mal weiter. Lieutenant. Respectfully, Captain. Here is my friend, the legate of the merchant congregation. She would like to ask you a few questions. At your orders. I'm listening, sires. How do the various squadrons in this camp differ from one another? The recruits I train are intended to carry out more subtle actions. Really? What kind? I teach them how to blend into the background, understand customs, observe, and know when to strike. That's strange. These skills are normally associated with assassins rather than soldiers. These skills are always useful. Regardless of the enemy or the setting. What kind of training do your men undergo? I can't go into details, but they learn discipline and to outdo themselves. You mean to blindly follow orders, even to their death? But I... No, Captain. We also teach them to analyze situations so that they know when to act to avoid risking their lives. How did you become an instructor in this camp? I have led numerous squadrons before, and I've trained hundreds of recruits on the continent. I worked with Captain Rolf in the past, and when I arrived on the island, he recommended me for this position. That's very impressive, and I expect that you're familiar with the natives' environment and magic. Yes, yes, of course. Hmm. Kurt. Don't you think that someone this talented fits what we're looking for? You see, we need to find someone who can replace Kurt to oversee my cousin's security. Your cousin is a governor of New Serene, I've heard. It's a prestigious position. I don't doubt my abilities, but an offer like this, made so suddenly, must have a price. We can't hide anything from you. We're trying to find out what happened to Rayner, a recruit who trained here. That name doesn't sound familiar. He must have been in the Shadow Squadron. The other Lieutenant's squadron? Yes. I'm sorry. Haven't been much use to you. Did something happen to him? He died. His body was thrown into the harbor to make it look like he drowned. I guess it was one of your recruits. My condolences, Captain. We'll question some of your soldiers. 
At your orders, but please be quick. I'd like to get on with training. Gut, jetzt müssen wir auch Rekruten befragen, aber ich will auch ihn da befragen. Lieutenant, Captain. My friend here would like to learn more about this camp. At your orders, Captain. Madam. Can you tell us about your squadron? The recruits who come here are the best. And in my squadron, they get even better. I don't know what else to tell you. They're disciplined, rigorous and effective. Exactly what you'd expect from the best soldiers. What kind of training takes place in your ranks? Combat in natural settings. Combat against the savages' magic. I'm very curious about how you train against the magic the natives use. Now these are complex, secret maneuvers. I'm very sorry, but I can't tell you any more. That's a pity. It would definitely be instructive. I heard the recruit Rainer trained here. What can you tell me about him? Oh, he was a good one. He died a little while ago. So we've heard. Your captain told us he died during a maneuver. Can you tell us more? The training we do outside can be dangerous. Unfortunately, Rainer fell to his death in a ravine. He fell? During a simulated ambush. I know, it's not glorious, but it happens. I'd like to get back to work now, if you'll allow it, Captain. Go on. We're gonna go talk to some of your recruits. I hope that it won't take too long. We're all very busy here. We'll be quick, Lieutenant. The story about training against magic is a lie. This Lieutenant has no idea what he's talking about. So what could they be training recruits for here, then? I don't know. But whatever it is, I don't like it. Soldier! Yes, Captain. At ease. We have some questions for you. Me? At your orders, Captain. You look exhausted. Is training that rough here? Well, it's difficult at first, but you get through it. Taming fatigue. That's the key to it all. Haven't you ever wanted to stop? You've never doubted your vocation. I'm not a coward, nor a weakling. The strength of the shadow. What is that? Your motto? Our squadrons, Captain. You seem concerned about your comrades. You keep looking at them. No, no, not at all. Are you afraid of what they might think of you? Absolutely not, Captain. We are all of one mind in this squadron. We are very united. Since this is such a close-knit squadron, you must have known Rayner. Yes, of course. But he's not part of the squadron any longer. He left. Really? I don't know what you're trying to get me to say, Captain. Rayner left the squadron because he was sent on a mission. There's nothing more to say. Huh? Sorry, mate, but that's not what happened. I, I don't know anything more. Thank you. That will be all. Thank you, madam. Captain. Good heavens. I feel like a bogeyman. These recruits are clearly scared to let any information slip. It's as if their life depended on it. Das ist ja interessant, dass sie da das erzählen und da das erzählen. Also da bin ich ja echt mal. Hm. Hello, soldier. Captain. We need information. Your instructor authorized us to question you. Of course, madam. I'm listening. How would you describe your training? Do you train outside the camp much? Yes, we do. Well, not exclusively. Really? Yet we've been told that your unit specialized in actions over difficult terrain. Uh, yes, I think so. Well, yes, that's true. Mm. Problems remembering things, soldier. No, Captain. What's it like in your squadron? Very good. The Phantom Squadron is made up only of the very best. Do you trust your comrades? We're like five fingers on one hand, madam. I would trust them with my life. You've sure got the military spirit. Yes, Captain. We've learned that a recruit died in an accident during a maneuver. Does this happen often? Uh, no, of course not. Only to those who aren't strong enough. That's strange. I was told that this recruit was very talented. I... I, I don't know what to tell you. It's possible. If you don't mind, I'd like to get back to my training. He seems afraid that an accident might befall him too. No, it's not that. I just don't want to fall behind schedule. Very well. 
Go on. Excellence. Captain. These kids are scared to death. Yes. This boy's answers about his training seem pretty dubious to me. He can't hide the lies. Soldier. Captain. At ease, soldier. We'd like to learn more about your training. I have nothing to say about it, my lady. Really? Go on, it's not a difficult question. What do you do during training? Is this a test, Captain? No, it's not a test. You may speak freely. Well, training is difficult, but we can't complain, Captain. Hmm, that's an interesting way to phrase it. You're very united in this squadron. At least, that's what I've been told. United? You could say that, yes. Until death. That's rather sinister. Does the name Rainer sound familiar to you? Yeah. Uh, well, no, not really. You seem rather hesitant. Afraid of being reprimanded by your lieutenant? No. Well, not at all. It's just that I can't tell you anything about Recruit Rainer. And we're lucky to have the lieutenant as our instructor, Captain. We should leave this soldier to his work. Your name, soldier? Wilhelm. Uh, first class recruit Wilhelm, Spectre Squadron. Keep it up, Wilhelm. Lieutenants, report. Captain? Could you give us a few minutes and take us around the site? I've never been here before, and I'm curious to see what goes on. I'm not sure if we can, Captain. We are on duty, Captain. Right, Lieutenant. Let's go. I... Are you coming with us? No, thank you. I'd rather stay here. Take in some fresh air. As you like. In that case, see you later. Ja, ich muss jetzt aber Schluss machen und sag Tschüss, bis zum nächsten Mal.